Hey guys, this is Sophia. And this is Kaden. Hi, Hi Socky siblings. siblings. And today we're going to be doing the three marker challenge. Round one is Encanto and round two is Harry Potter. We might have a round three and four and those are mystery ones. So we'll get to pick out of a hat. If we have around three, we're definitely having around four. So uh, now let's show more pictures. So we have Louisa for round one. Get up a little closer for yours because yours kind of has more detail. So we don't need blindfolds. I think we're just going to like cover up our eyes and look the other way to pick. Let's do rock, paper, scissors to see who goes first. That's kind of hard to get up. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Yay. Okay. Hold on. You have to one more. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay. Now let's see. This determines about who goes first. Not the big video. Just get to it. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors, scissors shoot. Rock. Whew, I almost did scissors there and I could have won. Dang it. Okay. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors, shoot. Dang yeah. it. I was just about to do paper. Okay. So. Okay, you can lay down if you want. Because we're getting lazy here. I literally have to lay in between the table. Okay, so cover your eyes. Now, look away and pick what this is. She's kind of a cheater, so I've got to make sure she's not peeking. Right here, Sophia. Okay, don't look at your first color. Just pick. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, open. So she got one light blue on her first pick, an orange on the second pick, and this blue on the third pick. Honestly, that's not terrible for Louisa, so. Yeah. <laughs> Could still be better than mine. So, I felt the skinny one second, and when I opened up, this was the last one. So, first pick, second pick, third pick. All right. So, those were some good picks. This means, you know what, we'll just keep those there. They'll be watching us. And we can start coloring our pages. We'll talk to you guys while I do that. I think there's one color that we got the same of. We both got this kind of light blue. I think I'm going to color her hair. I don't know what color, but I'll tell you guys. So. If I go brown, I will color the hair. So. What color are you going to do her hair? Well, her hair is going to be like dyed, so her hair is going to be more. Well, like... Yeah. But what is it going to be? Blue. Blue? Mm -hmm. That light blue? Yeah. Okay. I think I'm, I'm going to make hers maybe this purple. I'm not sure yet. I'm going to do her whole... Like her whole outfit and then her hair. You know what? She's going to be an alien. Her skin is going to be green. I've already decided on that. Okay. I'm just starting by coloring her clothes kind of purple. Like this part. I don't really know what to call it. but um, I, for, I feel like I can't remember any of the colors that Louisa has. Except for like red on the bow, I think. I remember she has a purple skirt. Okay, but you can't help. Okay, so. Alright, so Sophia right now, show them what you're outlining real quick. I'm outlining like, it's like the, um, it's like the skirt part. Okay, so yeah. she's outlining that in dark blue, I believe. Yes, dark blue. Yeah, dark blue. So. So that's and going for her. I don't want to make her shirt green because that's the color of her skin, so that would be weird. So I'm going to make the rest of her shirt uh, kind of light blue. Sophia, scooch your drawing back a little bit so they could see it a little easier. There. Well, they could see mine pretty easy because the coloring book is like a bit far. Alright, so now she's coloring in the skirt area. I'm currently doing this. Uh, we'll pause and make some footage from above, and then we'll check back with you guys once we're done coloring in all her clothes. 
and I've been trying to get the comments to work. Like I've been going to allow comments and resetting it a bunch of times, but it just hasn't worked yet. So if the comments aren't working, okay, hold on, keep coloring. Okay, if it's running out of, if it, oh, this marker doesn't work at all. So this one is pretty close to it. So I'll give you that one. Okay, so anyways, if the comments don't work, that's fine. But if they do work, I want you to put in the comments your favorite Encanto character. Um, mine is Dolores, I think. Sophia likes Mirabelle a lot. So. Okay. Let's keep coloring this in. La -da -da, la -da -da. I know I said I was going to stop right now, but I also have one more thing to say. We had to take the trailer back. I mean, the motorhome back to get it fixed. I don't really know why it had to get fixed. But... Anyways, we had to do that, so we haven't had it for a while, so I can't post Motorhome Challenge Part 2 yet, so there's going to be kind of a little wait for that. I hope you guys watch this video to see that announcement, but sorry, there was something in my eye. Still is, but now we'll show you guys some footage from above. So I'm watching. using orange because I I'm doing orange for the shirt because I didn't want to do too much blue. I'm using purple for her skirt because I don't want to use green for anywhere else. And I already put like a lot of blue up here because the green is going to be the color for her skin. But also, I'm pretty sure that blue is the color of Louisa. I mean, purple is the color of Louisa's skirt. So I'm pretty confident with this and I think it's going to look great. So, I went outside the line. Okay. Alright, so now I, this is what I've colored so far. Show them what you've colored so far. So, she's colored so far. And I know I didn't finish like all the details in her clothes yet, but I can't wait. I'm gonna start coloring her body green. And I chose to do green because I feel like her outfit is basically bluish purple. I don't wanna do all of it purple, so. And I didn't wanna use like a bunch of green in this, so she needs a skin color, right? So I'm gonna start doing green. You can start coloring like all the background stuff because I'm not gonna show them. As you can, guys can see, she has like a lot of stuff in the background of hers. Take like, mine is like a zoomed in picture, and hers is like zoomed out. Can Pretty I much the same picture. Yeah. Yes. So she's gonna actually do the letters, and then she'll do the background. So basically, that's in the background. So, all right. Oh, this green is running out already, but there's still some ink left, so maybe. I don't know who will work for her whole body, but she's like a bodybuilder, so she's got a lot of muscle to color in. Honestly, this green kind of looks good on her skin. But, and anyways. I'm outlining all of it and then coloring it in. Cool. So, uh, I gotta, like, push pretty hard to color this because... It's like, you might be able to tell, but, or you might not, but it's running out of ink. So, around the letters also, as you probably saw, pretty sloppy because it's hard to color right there. So, you have letters too. I know, I just said that. I said that around the letters are sloppy. <laughs> okay, so. Ooh, Louisa has a bracelet. I'm gonna color that. Uh, I don't color. Three marker challenge is pretty hard. It could be like four marker challenge, five marker challenge, but I don't. There also might be a part two if you guys want to see part three and part four. I feel like there's a lot. I 
I think we only have one or two two-parters, but I feel like that's a lot, so. I can't draw people crossing their arms, and I know, like, professional artists do coloring books, but I just can't draw people crossing their arms, and it seems, like, really hard. Ooh, so show them that. I was going to do that, like, where I outlined it a different color. The letters are looking really nice. And then maybe we could do Louisa's hair at the same time. Or once you're done doing the letters, you could start in the background or her skin color. My goal is done with the letters. I just need to color in the A. No. So I keep showing you guys this. But I really like the design around right here. So I might, if I have extra time and she's still coloring, I could color the background. You know, maybe like, I don't know. I feel like I should have a lot more colors than just three, but... Maybe we could do the hearts, I think. Alright, so the hearts in the background? Yes. Okay, so show them the hearts now. <laughs> so there's like one mini one and... Um, well, there's like a bunch of hearts. Like, mm -hmm. she's talking about all of these. So. Alright, what color are you going to color those? Um, I think I'm going to color them orange because orange is like... Pretty close to red. Yeah. And I'm going to orange. I was literally thinking you were going to say that in my head. Word for word. <laughs> oh, I was going to color that dot. I was like, what is it? But good thing I didn't because it's for Louisa. All right. Wait, what dot? That dot right there. So, uh, check back in with you guys when we're done. Well, when I'm done coloring the skin and when she's done coloring some background things now. We'll get some shots from the top. Just coloring the rest of her neck green. This is actually like a pretty nice green color for the skin. And I really, actually it kind of looks nice on Louisa. She looks like she would be this monster because of like all the muscle she has. And it just seems like a really good Louisa color. So honestly, kind of looks like Frankenstein's wife. All right, guys, Sophia, you don't have to show it right now. She's in the process of coloring the whole background. I'm done with Louisa's skin and this part of her, her outfit, sorry. Okay, now I'm going to color like this and this part and like the belts. So once you're done coloring like a couple more background stuff, you could show them. I'm almost done onto my Harry Potter round, but we gotta start that at the same time, so. Hmm, let's see. This one looks good. You know what, I'm just, yeah, okay. So I'm gonna color the background of this. All right, you might've seen, you might, you probably don't know what I'm talking about. But, and then like the little X's, purple. Sophia, if you finish, like, one more background thing, you could show them. Okay. All right, so this is what I meant by that. Do you get what I mean? Like, background blue, that little stitches. The least are going to be blue. That was the least? Mm-hmm. I should have did the least um, orange. Just yeah, you probably should have done least orange, but whatever. Yeah. Well, you don't have to do all the leaves the same color. They're different color leaves. Mm -hmm. Again, if the comments are open, put in there your favorite color leaf. That's really random, and you probably don't want to do that, but you don't have to. But still, it's a nice okay. color. And we have one more leaf, and I'm going to color you guys. Okay. Yeah. All right, Sophia's so, going to show you. This is what I did. Part. Background and um, her lowers and Louisa. So now, now you still gotta do some more flowers in the background. Ooh, and you have Louisa's shoes too. Uh, also, those stripes aren't part of her skin, but this is part of her skin. She's not wearing socks. I don't think. So oh, I'm gonna make it's her, up to her. Um, shoes now. What color are you gonna do her shoes? I think dark blue. Dark blue? Yeah. Nice. Alright, and then it's time for Louisa's hair, eyes, 
mouth, eyebrows, hair bow, and letters. I think I'm going to be for hair bow and you can do for mouth one. Yeah, I would do that too if I had one, but I don't. So. But also, I have purple, so that's a good thing. I feel like orange is good because it's close to like yellow and kind of skin color and like stuff like that, so. Oh, the shoes are looking nice. Bracelet, so he's probably like Louisa. Frankenstein monster alien Louisa. Got it all wrong, kid. So I finished the bracelet and this part. I think I'm gonna do the letters last because that's what makes Louisa Louisa her name. So I'm gonna do her hair. All right, so done coloring that part. I'm gonna do the bow green, represent her alien ancestors. Ancestors. All right, Sophia, you better start working on the skin or the hair or something. I'm gonna work on the hair. I also forgot one, a couple flowers, but start working on her body, because those are not the most important. Okay, so. Um. Oh, you said her skin color was gonna be light blue. So off camera, she said it's gonna be light blue. Because, hold on, let me show you real quick. The color, where is it? That, and light blue, so. At least her skin's got to be just light blue. So what color are you going to do her hair? Dark blue. Okay, dark blue hair, light blue skin. Operation, Louisa. Here we go. Interesting Louisa. Interesting. These Louisas are pretty interesting. Like, we've got Moana Louisa and Frankenstein Monster Alien is going to eat you, Louisa. No, don't eat me. Well, too bad, sister. You couldn't run fast enough and Louisa caught up to you. And then she ate you. And then your life was over. Unless you guys are fast. So. You guys She's better fast. be fast if once Louisa, once I'm done coloring Louisa, because... I was almost going to color her eyebrows. But you don't have purple. I mean, dark blue. Well, isn't that her hair color? Yeah. So then I think you shouldn't. So, um, look at you've got brown hair and brown eyebrows. So now I'm going to do the skin. The outlining doesn't really work good with a thick marker. Wait, I just realized that she got all the thin ones. All the little thin markers, but... Yeah, because we had to put that on. Yeah, but you could, like, feel around, kind of, and you could tell which ones aren't, aren't <laughs> thick and thin markers. Okay, interesting. Moana Louisa. I don't... You keep saying that Moana Louisa is interesting. She clearly hasn't looked at this for a while. Okay. Um, the letters are also... Bit, the letters are very interesting about mine. Mm -hmm. So. We've all got different opinions about her. She thinks her is interesting, but then I've got Monster Louisa. Okay, how much, like... <laughs> I had to teach her what... I had to pause <laughs> the video and teach her what an opinion was. Because she didn't know what it was. Pause teaching moment. If you guys don't know what an opinion is, it's like your own way about thinking about something. Like somebody, your best friend could say, wait, you like gymnastics? I hate gymnastics. But you could love it and you both have different thoughts about it and you both think me. about it as a different way. Like somebody could think about gymnastics as like a way to get hurt and a boring activity to do. But some people think of it as like amazing and fun. So they both, they all think about it in different ways. Somebody could think about it as, well, you could get hurt, but I guess it's fun. Okay, well. I don't want to do the background. I thought about it. Eh, too much work. My hands are tired already. So this is my Louisa. Sophia still honestly kind of got quite a lot to color. Color, so we'll check back with you when she's done coloring that. But this is my Louisa so far. Well, I finished with her, so. Finished product. 
Frankenstein monster Louisa, she's gonna start chasing you guys. Alright, I'm gonna go to the woods so they can see finished Louisa. Now time for Harry Potter round. Woo! Alright, we're gonna have to make a part two. So we're each doing one side of this for part two. Some golden snitches. The ball that Harry has to catch. So um, that will be round two. And we'll pick our markers next time. See you guys!